Hello, I'm Ilya from Bitscout. In this video, I wanted to show you how you can process line items from your invoices using Microsoft Power Automate. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna send ourselves an invoice and then we're gonna extract all the line items, okay? Now for that, I have already prepared a, a simple work, workflow in, um, sorry, a simple flow in Power Automate. When the email arrives, then I check each attachment then I use a get attachment function, then I use a BitScout um, uh, module extract data from invoice, which contains line items. And then the next step is quite tricky. What you need to do is you need to do like this. You need to go here and choose expression and expand string functions. And here you will find split text. And first item is the text itself you choose it from dynamic content and here you have line items there they are but then the last item is where you need to do a trick so basically what we're gonna do is csv is a file where each line is a new line so we need to break this this uh, huge csv table into lines individual line items for that we're gonna use a function called decode URI and I will show you what it is. It's called in conversions and this one. And the URI component here is pers percentage 0A. This is new line character. Okay, so now this item will sp split it into each and each and every line item it will split it into new items and then again from the outputs of the compose function let let me rename it splitting into individual positions okay and then we take and each and every line, we analyze each item. And then we need to split the item itself into positions where we're gonna use a split function, then type here item, which will take item from a previous apply to each, and then split it using this uh, symbol, which we use in BitScout. And then the next step is add a row into a table. And here, what you do is, you basically create an expression like this, percentage and then the mm, the column number let's say 20 and here you put dynamic content outputs and now it breaks it down so in BitScout there are 21 um, different values that we extract so let's say quantity is uh, number two and that's how you specify it and in our article, I will have, I will give you a breakdown, all right? So let's run a test. I already did a test today, so let's run it for the trigger. And what it will do, it will read the email, which I sent to myself, and then it will extract data into this Excel, where I map the fields, how I want it. So let's see. So now the flow is running, so let's see how the line items will appear in our Excel. So here we are. So I extracted description, price, quantity, well, in unit of measure. But here you have your line items popping out. You can use, uh, you can map different fields here in our, here into apply each. So let me edit this. Here you can change those things and basically say number two, three, four, again, the whole breakdown will be in the article, what is what. But now you can easily extract data from line items into your um, Excel. And of course, it's a little bit difficult. There are also uh, paid modules that you can use in Microsoft Power Automate. But if you, for some reason, don't want to do that, this is the way you can do this. Um, still, you might have lots of questions, so feel free to contact us and I will be happy to help you. Because even recording this video, I made some mistakes, so it's not easy and uh, it's okay to ask questions. Thanks a lot.